Peace to the Rosa family, it's me Clarkson. Can you see me? No, you can't. And now you can. All right, cool. Peace, 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 y'all. We are in La Merc Park. As you can see, the fist. That's black power right there. All right, y'all, so welcome to Clarkson Walks episode four. Uh, I wanted to show y'all some new locations. I don't just want to keep walking back and forth through the regular neighborhood. I want to show y'all one of the highlights of Los Angeles, which is one of my favorite places to go. Lamar Park. You know, this is a place full of culture, full of um, damn near everything, to be honest with y'all. I keep, see, I got to practice this vlogging thing because I always walk in areas where y'all can't see me. And I be watching vlogs on YouTube. They somehow always have it at the perfect angle everywhere they go and it's always good lighting so i gotta focus on that y'all i gotta focus on holding the camera just right the whole time you know have my arms stretched out all the way whoa and then still you know no camera shake and always good lighting all right i guess gotta... we're working on it okay but um today's vlog is going to be about really just capturing whatever goes down today because it's uh it's 2024 50 so it's a lot of new events going on in the merc I'm also going to be just telling y'all what's on my mind. Because these clocks and walks episodes are really just like mental. Uh, here we go again with the lighting. They're like mental diaries, y'all. I just want to jot down the thoughts that I'll be having. Because there's a lot of content last year that I feel like I could have captured but didn't. And I just left it as intimate moments, which is cool. But it's like seeing it in hindsight, I was like, damn, imagine if I recorded that. I would have been able to not only show y'all. But learn from it because if y'all don't know a lot of my content that i record i watch back myself and it teaches me lessons about myself and other things i see i gotta walk backwards just so the lighting stays the same oh the things we have to learn about content creation man i'm learning i'm learning i'm learning but we're getting there y'all we're getting there one step at a time we're getting there better with the content y'all see how up the quality on y'all so i hope y'all appreciate that one of my all-time fans just made this post yesterday saying his favorite content creators of 2023, and I was on that list. Y'all don't even know how good that made me feel. I'm like, what? Clarkson is on the list as favorite influencers of 2023? Now, yeah, that put a smile on my face. So, I'm much more um, committed now to sharing my knowledge and sharing instead of just internalizing, like, yes, yeah, the lesson I learned. The lesson I learned, like, no, nah, I have a responsibility as well to share with y'all and teach y'all what I've learned along this journey, you know, because it's not just me anymore. It's more than that. Clarkson, it's like I feel like y'all are also with me on this journey. It's like we are Clarkson in a way, you know? We are Clarkson. I like that. <laughs> so, with that being said, y'all going to be on my journey just like I'm with y'all journey, you know? I'll be helping out my fans all the time in the comments and the DMs, just like giving advice and stuff. So, it's vice versa, you know? We help each other out. Y'all be watching my videos, support my Instagram, you know? So, it's a reciprocal thing, and I love it. So, yeah, y'all. We, we, uh, we're going to take a short walk through Lamert. I'm going to record some stuff, and um, it's going to be cool. So, what's words of wisdom for today? What's on Clarkson's mind? Hmm. Um, I would have to say, today I'm just, I'm just uh, really content, you know? I'm really content on the things I'm doing. And I've made this little, I told myself I wasn't going to talk about this, but at the same time, there's a key to manifestation that you have to bring into the universe first. And since I'm recording it, I'll say it's better, you know, because if I'm just talking about it, it might not always get manifested. But since I'm recording, that's a different story because I can look back on this later. I can reflect on this and amplify whatever message I'm saying now. So I'm going to tell you all what I was planning for the past um, day or so. I'm gonna do this three month trial on myself when it comes to the music stuff, okay? And with that, that'll give me like a three month type of boot camp to launch my music career and everything I need to do in music. You know, I'm gonna give myself three strong months all the way until my birthday. So we got January, February, and March to go crazy on the music. I'm talking about heavy practice drills, rehearsals, everything I possibly need to get my music career ready. Even when it comes to distribution, like all that, because I'm gonna be doing it, I'm gonna be uh, doing everything myself, basically. So self distribution, all the knowledge and all the practice and all the things I need, I'm gonna try to cram that in th three months. I was watching this uh, La Russell vlog because he has this thing where he just calls, um, what's it called, La Russell walks or something like that. 
that's kind of where I uh, got inspired to do the Clarkson walk because I'll be watching his videos. Oh, it's called GCTV. I'm sorry, because this company is Good Company, so it's called Good Company TV. And so he just goes on these walks and talks about whatever is on his mind, right? It's real cool. And that's where I got inspired to do Clarkson walks. And what he was saying on his vlog is he wants to do the same things he accomplished in one year. He wants to try to do that in the first quarter. I'm like, damn, that's crazy. But it's powerful at the same time, and I want to do that. So I did a lot of things last year, and now I know what I can do if I really put the work in. So I'm going to try to cram these next three months as if it was like a year's worth of work. So from January, February, I hope y'all can hear me. But from January, Fe February, and March, I'm about to cram so much work in, it's going to feel like I did a year's worth of work by the time I'm 24, y'all. So by the time I'm 24, I'm going to be a whole new level of clocks on all levels like i just got this workout routine i'm in i'm also gonna be sharing that with y'all it's time to get bulky y'all we, 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 i've been skinny for too long <laughs> i'm like 155 pounds and i'm six foot like that's not where i want to be i'm trying to be at like 175 180 you know i want to be uh bigger but i'm super tall which everybody keeps telling me but i'm not at the weight i want to be at you know i'm more closer to bruce lee weight which is not my desired weight no, no offense to anybody who's this way but it's like for me for my body type because i'm like an ectomorph so i don't really it's hard to put on weight y'all it's really hard i'm like really lean but i know if i do the right regimen and work out properly i can get the weight you know the healthy muscle weight that i need so that's the plan before 24 and also this music you know that's the number one thing so i've been putting some things into motion and i'm gonna take y'all on my journey so number one the goal is consistency and with me making these videos this helps me actually remind myself of all the things i need to get done and it also allows me to share it with y'all so this, this this me vlogging is like a dual positive effect that's why there's no cons with this because not only am i learning but i'm also sharing with y'all so but enough of me yapping y'all i'm about to go stroll around the mert we're gonna see what today has to offer us y'all because every day is a good day if you make it a good day it's all about perception bro. If you see things as good, it could become good because we are alchemists in our own life. So try to transmute everything in your life into something that can be usable, even if it is quote unquote negative. Find the use in it. Find the positive in it. You know, in my culture, we say take the best parts. So take the best parts of your life, y'all. But anyway, let's get to this walk.